Hello! Happy Thanksgiving to all. I'm hoping you're having a wonderful turkey day, if anything, a moderate one. Whatever the case, I really do hope that you guys have an excellent Thanksgiving this year. I actually wanted to tell you a story that's leading me up to why I'm reviewing this movie. Yesterday, Snapchat had a very interesting filter. And I thought to myself, why would they put this on there for the sake of Mrs. Doubtfire? This doesn't make any sense. But I did a Snapchat that day, didn't think anything of it, and then I moved on. And then today happened where it's Thanksgiving and I felt, you know, maybe I should just do a video and say well wishes to everyone who watches my videos and to anyone who pretty much needed a good start to the day because I'm cool like that. And, you know, it was funny because I thought, you know, doing just a simple video of Thanksgiving and telling you thanks and stuff like that would be great, but I really want there to be a purpose. What if there was a movie that came out this day? And so I looked it up and just by mere thought and the way things had kind of just turned to be, I looked up Mrs. Doubtfire and it came out this day. I was floored, so I thought, you know what, I might as well do it. This is just too ironic and coincidental, for me at least. If everyone knew this, fine, that's great. But for me, <laughs> let's review Mrs. Doubtfire. Mrs. Doubtfire stars Robin Williams, Sally Field, Pierce Brosnan, and various other talents that you recognize even today. And it's directed by Chris Columbus, who did the first two Harry Potter films and later on in his career. Robin Williams stars as Daniel Hillard, and he is a freelance voice actor of sorts where he becomes a little disagreeable with the script that he was currently voicing in the beginning of the film. And, you know, he quits. Where Daniel Hillard is one of the lovable father figures, he enjoys his kids, he enjoys being who he is, He's not a very reliable husband, because on the flip side of that, Miranda Hillard, she is a complete businesswoman. She completely dedicates herself to making sure that things are kept as they are. Miranda is very business-oriented, so she dedicates herself to work. And with that, it kind of introduces Pierce Brosnan's character, Stuart. Oh, hey, he's a business partner of sorts, but it just sets up just enough to make you go, oh... Potential love interest. Uh, here we go. Everything kind of is introduced in the beginning. Daniel Hillard quits his job but throws a party for one of his kids that he just... He goes to town on this party. He brings in animals, a whole bunch of kids, and it causes a rift with one of the neighbors. So when Miranda finds out about this when she's at work, this causes one hell of an issue. It results into a divorce. Miranda's not happy. Daniel is just trying to do everything he can. It just wasn't... It wasn't fitting. And so the kids kind of get left in the mix. But it's not like Daniel wanted that to happen in the first place. In fact, he really wants to be with his kids. And it's kind of worth it for him because these kids are amazing to him. And they're actually likable and followable at the same time. The courts are not working in Daniel's favor because he's unreliable, he, because he's not stable. He doesn't have custody of the kids. Miranda does. She has sole custody of them. This sends Daniel, like, over the edge. Like, I can't be without my kids. You can't do this to me. And, unfortunately, he's got no leg to stand on. So, he has a lot of work to do. He has a new life to settle into. And, also, he's going to be without his kids. So, he's definitely in a rut. But there is a saving grace to all of this. Miranda can't always be for there for the kids. While she's working, she needs someone to look after them. So she places an ad for an housekeeper. And guess who takes advantage of that? So after a few tries of calling in for a housekeeper, you know, it completely turns Miranda off. She's just kind of like, this is a nightmare. Little does she know that Daniel Hillard is at the voice of every single one. She's at her wit's end, she's not really sure if this is a good idea, and then Daniel comes in nailing it home. He makes the persona of Mrs. Doubtfire. But when he does, he has to actually show up. He actually has to be the said housekeeper. He can't just show up as himself and going, actually it was me, hello. No, he disguises himself, thanks to his brother.
Robin Williams, everyone! <laughs> and this is where things really kick off, and this is where you see so many hilarious moments in when Daniel Hillard's trying to make a balance in his life, in the way he has this double life, so to speak. This is where it capitalizes on his complete performance, and of course, Robin Williams brings it all. He brings his A-game, and then he brings several other A-games. It's just, he's a tour de force. This is such brilliant performance from Robin Williams. Yes, it does showcase a little bit of Robin Williams and the way he does things, but it just absolutely works to its finest degree. This could not have been made for anybody else. And everyone else brings their A-game as well. You have Sally Field, she's a businesswoman, but she isn't the bad guy. Stuart, Pierce Brosnan, holy crap, you can't hate him. I mean, yeah, maybe if you kind of go, well, he's trying to get in there and try to become more of the father for the kids than, than you know, Robin Williams, and that's not good. Of course it's not good, but he's not, he ain't a dick about it. He actually likes the kids. He actually loves Miranda. He's just kind of in the wrong place at the wrong time, but doing the right thing for what isn't provided for the kids. Little does he know that Daniel's coming in in the mix of all of this. Guys, in the end, everything kind of just falls into place as it needs to. This movie is hilarious. Things work, things actually help the story along. I don't really feel like there's a wasted opportunity here. I think that a lot of people can enjoy this for all ages, for all that it's worth. Robin Williams makes it so unique in its own way. It shows a struggle in a funny light. It shows emotion as it needs to without going, hey, we just gave us a serious moment here. Let's make it funny now. No, it's like, we just gave you something real. And now we just gave you something funny. Real. Funny. Real. Funny. And it balances it so well. And you got to hand it to, you know, Mr. Daniel Hillard because he's really living a double life, but he just makes it so effortless. And he just does it because he's fueled by the love for his kids. Of course, you guys know that I love this film. There's nothing more that can be said about it than I absolutely cared about what happened in this film. I own it, obviously, and 100% love it. Have you guys seen Mrs. Doubtfire? What did you think about it? What are you guys doing for this Thanksgiving holiday? I am doing this for the reason that, you know, Mrs. Doubtfire kind of capitalizes on family and it shows the dedication there can be for that. Now, there are some people out there, I'm getting a little real here for a minute, bear with me, but there are some people here that, you know, don't want to be with family. They can't stand it. They don't want to be. And depending on your situation, I would understand. Family means everything to me. So whenever I say, oh, make sure you're, you know, very thankful for your family, there are some people who don't have their families. There are some people who don't want to be around their families. So I always say, always find somebody who makes you feel like you. And make sure that you are around people that love you because that is what Thanksgiving is all about. Be thankful for them, but also be around them because they made you who you are. And that is always, always important. And that is the reason why I have made this video to show you thanks for watching. Thanks for my family, who family is where my home is. I could be anywhere at this point making this video and still tell you the same thing. Family is my home. And I hope the same applies for you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really enjoyed doing this. It was a lot of fun. At the same time, I hope you guys have a fantastic Thanksgiving and I will get you more videos in the future.